Okay. Going to take another run at Lone Echo. Can you tell me why we have unsecured cargo in the hold? Negative. Okay, well, we might want to look into that. All right, Jack. Looks like there's a lot to do this morning. Any priority alerts? Well, it will be your station soon. What problem do you want to tackle first? Send the data to my ARM computer. I'll have a look. Liv, what is this model doing here? Did something knock that loose? I was going to pack it up so I could take it with me to Ceres. I'll get to it at some point. Eventually. Probably. I'll set a reminder. I need to open my ARM computer. Let's see. Take a look at your objectives on your ARM computer and let me know which one you want to address first. Let's fix the power failure in the oxygen garden. Okay, follow me. Looks like the power failure knocked out the door to the oxygen garden. I'll pull the manual release. And of course, the access panel is stuck. Jack, I think you're going to have to cut through. I'll need to calibrate my reactive cutter first. Right. Considering the power outage, let's also calibrate your entry light. <clears throat> reactive cutter and headlamp calibrated successfully. Copy that. Cut through the access panel so we can pull the door okay. this handle. Excellent, follow me. Let's get started. Hmm. Hope you're not afraid of the dark. Can you use your headlamp to help me find the electrical grid maintenance panel? Affirmative. Olivia, I've located the maintenance panel. Perfect. Keep your light on it for a moment while I remove the cover. It looks like we've got some fused wiring. Status report? Sure, caused a full system crash. We'll need to reset each of the environmental controls. Can you find the emergency junction while I sort out this mess? Liv, this airlock has been inoperable for 57 days. And when that hits 64 days, it'll no longer be my problem. You mean it will be my problem? Heavy is the head that bears the crown, Jack. I've reached the junction cover. Did you bring a spanner? Just cut through the bolts. We can deal with the cleanup after we figure out what's wrong with the station. Affirmative. Going hot. Electronic interface. I'll need to use my scanner to link up with the I.O. port. Emergency power online. The backup conduit only has enough juice to diagnose one system at a time. Go ahead and get started when you're ready. Okay. I had to watch some tutorials to figure out how to do some of this stuff because it was just is not The O2 mixture is off. I'll need to adjust the levels of atmospheric exchange. Careful with that, Jack. One of us still has to breathe the air here for the next few days. Because there is The air composition needs to stay balanced, Jack. Bio-regenerative systems calibrated. CO2 capture optimized for both plant and mammalian passengers. Mammalian, huh? How flattering. Apologies, Liv. I didn't mean to sound... clinical. Once I'm gone, you'll probably be able to shut down this part of the ring. I think I'll keep it, actually. To add color. Jack, you aren't starting to enjoy botany, are you?
Is that unusual? Depends who you ask. So, I gotta turn it over here. And this points that direction, so it kind of takes you there, I guess. The alert must have shut down water flow to the hydroponic systems. Water flow restored. Irrigation system within operating parameters. Good. Uh, shut off my laser. Use the junction to select another system. Uh, then you gotta turn it this way to get over there to work on that sucker. You will certainly be leaving Kronos 2 with a vast surplus of duct tape, Liv. That's because duct tape fixes everything. The transformer can't form a complete circuit. We probably need to realign the coils. Run a scan to confirm. The coils have been damaged. Hmm, shit. Unlock them so we can get a closer look. Conversion coils unlocked. As long as we can still form one complete row, we should be able to get the transformer back online. He's gonna line up on this bottom row. Stabilized. Conversion process successful. Current strong. Nice job. Once I finish replacing these wires, we should be able to get the lights on. That's two down. Let's tackle the last system. What should I be doing right now? Use the junction to select a system to recalibrate, Jack. They're all recalibrated. Aren't they? That one's good, that one's good. The O2 balancer is online. I should check on the atmospheric composition. Uh. What's wrong with the atmospheric composition?
Para, verify all oxygen garden subsystems. Subsystems within normal parameters. Right. I'm about done here. Oh. Do you see the access panel near me? Okay, that was it. Didn't have that one quite right. What should I be doing right now? There's something wrong with the O2 balancer. Look into it, would you? No, there isn't. <laughs> you just told me to go after the access panel. Okay. Let's mess them up and set them over again. So, set this one to 100. Set this one to about 80. And set this one to 20, about 20. And what's wrong with that? I should check on the atmospheric composition. I just there and things so pesky. The O2 balancer is online. I should check on the atmospheric composition. And where the hell is the atmospheric composition? Let me shut you off, you son of a... Atmospheric composition, eh? Which is the balance. The atmospheric composition is the balance. Okay, let's just reset the darn thing again.
Out of balance, eh? The O2 balancer is online. I should check on the atmospheric composition. Out of balance. Why the hell is it out of balance? You're balanced, you son of a mule. Something screwed up there. The tutorial that I found that these are the settings, and at least once I got the prompt to go over and uh, there's an access panel over by Olivia that I'm supposed to open up next. And at one point it asked me to do that, then it stopped and said that this thing was out of balance again. So I'm going to retire for for now, I guess. Hope you like this video. Please hit thumbs up on it. If you enjoyed it, please subscribe to see more of these types of videos. But uh, anyway, thank you for watching.